it's a quick video on a couple of edgings <clears throat> there's loads more on uh, youtube um, as you can see this is stocky net and it's rolling um, i don't if i steam it too much it'll just die um, you can do it on live stitches this happens to be a, a weaving cast on but it doesn't really matter um, so i'll show you how to do a couple of edgings you go from right to left and i've picked up this is called a mock cable i've picked up edge stitches here six of them this time to start with i've got some horrible yarn i don't like here but it'll show you what's happening easier i usually do it about one hole tension lower than i did the stocking netting but it doesn't really matter so i'm going to try and do this do i picked up six do six rows you can see that then take the three stitches on the left move them over put them onto those three stitches i pull them out less likely to fall off then and then pick up another three edge stitches put them on those and knit six rows and then do the same again try not to nudge the video camera pick up another three I'll just do a few more and then you can see what it looks like to see that forming probably doesn't show up as well in this variegated yarn as I say you can do this on live stitches on edge stitches on cast on stitches Try not to pick up one of the stitches we've already picked up. Right, hopefully you can see that's what the wrong side looks like. And that's what the right side looks like. And it's just a sort of twisted edging. But if you just give that a very light steam, um, stops it curling. Now I'll do the good old... Um, worm trim as it's called you pick up in fact i'll take that off and ignore that worm trim very similar pick up three stitches because you're going right to left pick up three stitches hang them on and do six to eight rows so we'll do eight And with this, you just pick up the stitches and put them on top of those stitches. Obviously, you can do maybe four stitches, and ten rows or four stitches and eight rows or three stitches and six rows. It doesn't really matter. Depends how wormy you want it, and I will continue doing a few more rows of this and then show you what it looks like off the machine. There's the two edgings, there's the worm, and then the mock cable edging after steaming. And then there'll be, um, I'll show you a picture of uh, 
one I prepared earlier.